I'm Victoria Bork, owner of Victoria Bork Beauty Boutique, and we're here with our model Olivia today to demonstrate how to apply a false set of eyelashes. First and foremost, pre-measure the eyelashes before applying. They're going to come extra long to suit all eye shapes. You want to make sure that they don't extend too long on either side of the eye. So I've already pre-cut and measured to Olivia's eye. So I'm going to apply uh, my eyelash glue. I like to use it on the back of my hand. I am using a black eyelash glue, which I do prefer because it gives a little bit of depth to the eyelash line. It makes them look fuller. It's almost like an eyeliner. Give it a minute for the glue to get tacky. You're going to start by pressing the center and the center of the lid and then work with adhering your outer corner and your inner corner. And using tweezers really helps to get more precision. And don't try too hard not to blink because that will make your eyes water and won't let the glue dry. Start in the center of the lid, and you want to make sure you get it as close to the lash line as possible. And another tip, a really important tip, is not to go too close to the inner corners of the eyes. As you can see with Olivia's eye, I left maybe five millimeters from the inner corner. If you bring them too close together, you end up feeling that throughout the day, and it'll cause irritation. Your eyes may get a little bloodshot, and you're going to want to remove them earlier on. So avoid going too close to the inner corner. And lashes really help to complete a look. So especially when you're doing a softer look like we have on Olivia's eyes here today, it just helps to give a little bit more emphasis on the eyes without getting too dramatic and too colorful. Just using a little bit of a liner just to go over top of the lash line will just help make this look a lot more natural. Inner corner is the most important part that I just mentioned to you. So once you've done this step, I would recommend applying mascara. It's everyone's personal preference whether you do this before lashes or after. Now Olivia did have a little bit of mascara on before, but the whole purpose of doing it afterwards is to merge both her artificial lash and her natural lash together so you don't see from a side view the two separate lashes. I just like to use my finger so that I can catch it and it doesn't ruin her eyeshadow and just merge the two lashes together. It'll make them look more natural, they'll feel less heavy, they'll feel more natural on you. So as you can see, it's just a really good completion for a full makeup application. It's something that we offer at the boutique um, as an addition to a makeup application or on its own as a service or even just to help you learn how to do it yourself. So come check us out, give us a visit and we'd be happy to help you with a false eyelash application for your next special occasion.